Good morning everybody and welcome to a familiar site, Plymouth train station. We've been here many times before on a video and today we are going to Rotherham away but it's actually currently Thursday and not Friday and we're playing on a Friday and not a Saturday. It's very confusing but it's the biggest game of the season. Massive game. Uh, Rotherham are bottom, we can actually relegate them. We've just sacked Foster and we've got a new manager so pretty important matchup. Well, I say new manager, technically we got a new manager, but we've got the old manager and the interim coach and Nanceville and Deuce. It's very complicated, but yeah, we've got new people at the helm, so hopefully they can lead us to glory against Rotherham. The reason why we're going up today is we're going to the darts tonight in Manchester, which there'll be another vlog for, for the darts. And then this vlog should be out, I don't know what day you'll see this, hopefully on Saturday, that is the plan. Hopefully in a minute the train will actually be here and uh, yeah, we've got a bit of a trek today. We're going to London Paddington, then we're changing and then we're going to Manchester. I actually got like three split tickets, I think, to Tiverton, then to London, then to Manchester. It's very complicated, but she's ruined the outro again. Either way, let's get on the train. Here we are, once again, in the usual place where we end up on these vlogs. London Paddington. Once a, a bear from Peru came in. What a boy. I tell you what though, be careful if you go in the Paddington. Stop. Why is it every time she blooming interrupts me? Every single, every single blooming vlog. Say it, see it, sort it. I know, I hear it 70 times a day. I was gonna say, be careful if you go to the Paddington shop, cause uh, it'll have to cost you to remortgage. So, but basically, yeah, it worked out cheaper to go to London to then go to Manchester and it's like half an hour longer, but it's ridiculously cheaper. So, smart way of doing it. Hopefully you get some nice advantage. And yes, I'm going standard premium before you want to give me abuse. Yeah, abuse more you want, okay, I'm going standard premium because it's a good value, it's a nice bit of leg room and it's a comfy chair. And I got the tickets for a very good price, so. Yeah, we're in the right belly here of, uh, of Paddington. So plan is up down in a every time that I was going to say a taxi to Houston before she rudely interrupted me again. Also, as well, I would actually have it on now, but it's in my bag. But I have been working on the mic, so because I'm a technological idiot, technophobe, so we will have that. Also, people say they do enjoy the fact that it's ridiculously amateur hour here. So, a fool with a camera is pretty much what these vlogs are. So, I will carry them on like that for the terrible and abysmal quality. Um, but yeah, that is what I was going to say. Sorry for the shambolic videography standards of this channel. And it probably will go not very much in an appropriately direction. Yeah, that was hammer it, hammer it down here. Oh, draw down hand there, mate. Welcome back. Not a station I use often actually, London Euston. Little fact by the way, if you are traveling, that London Euston does have beyond me a Nando's. Now, if I wouldn't go to Nando's later, I would do it and I have done it before. Ordered for collection, taken on the train and gone. So yeah, if you want a little bit of a travel advice, they got like a upper crust and very king. I mean, literally, it's like a services actually, this station. It's blooming huge, but it's always chaos and it's always carnage. But our next train's in like, just have a look at the board now. 15, 20 minutes, I was preparing. So that's what I did, like boarding at approximately 11.56. What time is it now? 11.50, so we ain't got long to go. Uh, yeah, what I was trying to say on the last bit was, I, I am a bit useless when it comes to like the camera and the audio and the awkwardness of like vlogging and trying to sort it out, but we're getting there slowly but surely. So we might add a little bit of a professional aspect into some videos, like I've got some football stuff to record and some dark stuff. But you've got a lot to do this week, basically. So, yeah, there's going to be quite a few vlogs coming out. We've got this one, which is 
part one of Rotherham and then part two will continue tomorrow. We're going to have, I think we're supposed to be playing darts against Luke Littler. Uh, we're supposed to be playing against darts Angry Ginge at the darts in Manchester, which is where we're going tonight, which will be another vlog. And then we're also supposed to be recording a football video. So it's going to be pretty mental. So I think tonight, as I say, is darts. So we'll have this vlog. Then it should be either the darts vlog or the game against uh, Littler. Then another vlog and then football vids. So we've got like four vids. Busy, busy, busy weekend. Anyway, yeah, I'm going to get ready for the, uh, for the next train. Just seen this, by the way. Love it. Take a penny, leave a penny system at Euston Station. If you're cold, get yourself a scarf. Sorry, mate. Quite like that. Big fan of that. Right, we're nearly in Manchester. It has been nearly a six hour journey. We're in Slander here, by the way, my rucksack, right? Yes, it's a shambles, but I paid a tenner for it and it still does the job. So I'm not getting a new one yet until it's destroyed, okay? It's still, no, I'm not getting, right, I'm not getting a, a Louis Vuitton backpack. How much is that? Right, that, there's a Louis Vuitton backpack with two and a half thousand pounds. Who pays that for a rucksack? This was a tenner, a tenner, and it's still in working order, all right? Yeah. Okay, if you keep abusing me in the comments though, I might cave and get a new one. Blue for someone. Right, that is here. We are in Manchester. Manchester. Piccadilly. Uh, this will probably be it for the first part of the vlog now because, as I say, we've got some other stuff to film while we're here. And then we most likely will pick up part two of the Rotherham vlog uh, when we get back uh, tomorrow. So that'll probably be it. Uh, I believe we're heading out there tomorrow evening. So yeah, that's what we'll have. We'll have Rotherham and all the glorious sights the New York Stadium has to offer. And hopefully I'll go win. So yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. I don't know what we'll transition to, but yeah, we'll see you there. Well, actually no, I'll be viewing by about a second, but it will be tomorrow. Look at Bateson, look. Bateson, that is incredible. You know what these are, don't you? What, what, are they the ones, the Ray-Bans with the, with the, look yeah, at so that touch. So when I hit a first person shot. Yeah, it could actually film it. Go on, mate, give us a little bit of it. Look. Sorry, professional. Oh, boy. Oh, Jesus, Lord, he's at the bottom more than anything else. So, we bring you back to the vlog. I've got the mic here because the wind is terrible, so I'm kind of like testing and playing around. We have got Luke the Nuke, we've got Bateson, OJC, FG, Ginger's off, going to the loop. We're going to film a football video which will be out on the channel soon. Uh, and then we're heading to Rotherham. So, yeah, a little bit of extra vlog stuff. See, in my head, I am the world's worst vlogger. Last night we filmed a darts vlog. Um, and I'll tell you that, we played the worst darts I've played. Wind boy is ruining my head, which is terrible. Um, we played. Uh, on the stage and uh, I can confirm I was absolutely abysmal so the plan is get this filmed get to Rotherham I oh, see I'm so bad look like the mic is here and I'm not even holding it properly testing testing one two <laughs> and uh, yeah I mean Bateson is literally there in a referee outfit and his Ray-Bans got a few hours of footy and hopefully Argyle can win tonight but I am a little bit worse for wear as you'll see the dodge vlog when it comes out <laughs> it is a shambles and uh, yeah I am a terrible vlogger oh there we go look there's as a ginger man. Yeah. Right, I don't know how far we are into the shoot so far. We've done, I think, about two hours, two and a half hours. My right foot is absolutely screwed, but I did score a pearl around it, so hopefully that'll be out. And I'm about to take on some sort of like first touch challenge. No one has scored, I don't think. Can I get one? Who knows? But no, I'm buzzing for Argyle tonight. I don't know what it is. Right, football video done. Legs absolutely done in. That one is going to be out soon, but once again, we have come 
to my favourite place, which I do try not to eat, I promise. We are in McDonald's again, and I'm going to order the whole restaurant. Luckily, shout out to my mate Peters, who's now giving us a lift. Uh, we're going to head to Rotherham for the match. Nah, mate, I'm getting a feast. I'm, getting, I'm literally getting an absolute feast. It says we're in Bones, though. I mean, I'm actually throwing that, that voiceover, you could put that voiceover in. It literally says, I've just seen a sign that says, Welcome to Barnsley. Um, where, where's it gone? <laughs> Lovely road mind. So, we are here in sunny Rotherham, as I say for everywhere. Is it very sunny? No, I've actually got my Argyle colours on today, only because uh, I couldn't be bothered to get changed after the shoot, and I'm absolutely knackered, to be fair, but I can see the banana bus slot. Andy, 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 Dad, just, I'm now getting abuse from them. Have it! Who wants it? Aaron Hawking, who wants it? Yeah, excuse the absolute state of me and the fact that I'm knackered, because honestly, after the, the darts vlog, which you guys will see after this, pretty much, I didn't get in Lichy Kipper probably until it was late. It was gone 3am in like the hotel bar, and then literally, yeah, then probably, oh yeah, probably got about three hours sleep. Got up this morning, went to Littler's, and then ended up doing the football video. Up the gap from there. Ended up doing uh, like a video there. Then went, then went to football. Did like football videos for like four hours. Then come here. I'm on like no sleep. I'm absolutely shattered. I'm falling asleep probably in the first half. But now nah, monster game today. Monster, monster, oh. monster game. So Kipper, who goes in the bus every week from literally Nuki, which is like an hour further. Then we go. How many how many grounds have you done, Kip? Do you know? 78 football league grounds. Uh, in the current National League, yeah. Yeah. Uh, I've got two more to do this season. That's uh Is that the eight? I got the Stoke. New Den and Stoke. I got Stoke, yeah. And about 25 in Europe. Mate, that's a pretty including the new camp and the San Siro. Uh, hey, loves it. Because you lived, how long have you lived in Belgium for? Two years. Two years. Who was your, your local team was it? Beveren. Beveren. So I don't know if there's any random Beveren fans out there, but you said you live with all that same street yeah. around. The Blauer Gale, the blue and yellow. I love it. I love little things like that. Mate, 67. The only downside is now, at least you get a cheaper ticket, I still got to pay for, <laughs> <laughs> I still got to pay full price. Stadium is somewhere in here. That way, and it's a round stadium, and therefore, if you walk around the other side, it's cheap. It's what? It's what? Thanks, man. Righty, look at this stuff. I've got my mic because the audio in the stadium is very loud and they've been playing music the whole time. So unfortunately the voiceover guy doing the the Rotherham lineup, you know, is uh, very loud. I have been here before, twice. I don't think I've ever seen us win here, I could be wrong. I did actually see Sam over the pub and he did say he will come in for like a feature. Because you guys like his facts and he said he's got some I, I, say, I use the word fun facts, I don't know whether they're quite fun, but he has got some facts and stuff that he said uh, that he's going to use for the video, so I'll try and find him in a little bit. He's probably getting a pie, but last time I seen him, he had, he had, a, he had a side note. This is like the earliest I think I've ever got into a ground. It's like half an hour before kickoff, but I'm so tired. I can like literally shut my eyes and sleep here. I cannot, cannot, cannot wait to get into bed. Also, I apologise if the background audio is like very loud and is being picked up well, then again, I am the world's worst vlogger, so sorry about that. It's to be expected with the level and quality of these videos. We made four changes tonight though, so we got chances. I believe if we don't win, there'll be tears. If we do win, absolute levels and limbs. So I don't know how much the game will actually see, because again, every vlog I do is a shadow, which makes you see the darts one. Who knows? 
is a superstar for the vlog, Jill. Goes every game, takes all the photos for the club. What a woman. Legend. Have you ever missed a game this year, have you? I have missed one. No. <laughs> Where did you go? Where did you go? Where did I go? Um, or did you Lanzarote. Go? Oh, sure. well, that's a good reason that's not to watch our club. <laughs> but now, we've got to give Jill a shout. It's people like her that need the real, you know, the real deal. And every week she takes the photos, and every week she's here, and every week she looks after us. <laughs> Legend. I don't, how many years have you been going now, Jill? Oh, too many to be <laughs> Too many? I love it. Thank you. Yes, well, you know, first game after Ian Foster sacking, be remiss of me not to do something. Only my second visit to New York Stadium. The first time I was here, we told Freddie Ladapo he was shit about 10 seconds before he put them into the lead. I've uh, had a few drinks, Ian Foster's gone, it's all good. Right, have we got any more top stats um, we've not won here at the New York Stadium at all. Tonight could be a good time to start. We've not won at any of our game away for 20 years. Matt Dumbe was the winner that day. There we go. Up the Argyle. in the cup shot. Hey, no trifle today, Kaz, but you said we're going to win. He's going to win. 2-1. He's demolishing a Mars ball. I could think to Could you do it one? <laughs> I'm a, I'm a gentleman. Go on. see that gag reflex. Just a, just a, just a, just a <laughs> the German football is that exciting. Kerr's eating a Mars bar is currently the highlight of the match. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> In our halftime thoughts now because we couldn't because of the music. The debate has been sensational. What's today's debate? What's the most southerly club in Yorkshire? Who do you think it is, Kev? Sheffield United. Oh, is actually. He's said Barnsley. I did, I did think it was. How is Barnsley? I did hear Barnsley. Yeah, Barnsley. yeah David, you're a northern. You're, yeah, you're a northern green, you should know. Top fan. We're actually winning the game. Will they come out of that? It's the pride of South Yorkshire. I got our winning game. And the hot debate. Right, happy days, we've won the game, a visible game of football, but we got the job done and that is all that matters. We have now got a very yes! long fair joke. Go on the boys! He loves it, look. He loves it. Get in there! Bloody nice gaff this. How much am I gonna have to remortgage for this? Five pounds eighty-five for a chicken Caesar wrap. That's actually that's actually criminal cost of coffee. Like actually criminal. How the hell do I get the tuna melt? I'm having that. Right, we've got our remortgaged WH Smith scram, we've got our remortgaged Costa scram, and I'm on the way home. Thanks again for watching today's video. I've got to give a shout out to the driver, Jason Pierce. He's got, is that not, no, there's a hot chocolate there. Have you got an oat latte in there? Not this time. No, vanilla. likes to want a vanilla latte. Very, very posh. Um, I'll tell you what though, all I will say is the lady in Costa was lovely. Costa, help the lady out, man. She, she's on her own, she got a queue all night. Come on, how much, do, how much do they earn a year? Help her out, please. Anyway, if you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to drop a like and subscribe if you are new. Argyle, horrific game of football, but it doesn't matter. We won. Thank the Lord. Roll on QPR Tuesday. Much love. Good night.